All right, high floors. Ultimate Ultimate Kirby is here, and yep, here it is. We are finally going to finish off this game, Gal Guardians Demon Perch. So last time, we basically uh tried to we actually did pretty much you know rescue all the students slash staffs and try to get all the power ups power ups for my for Shinobu and Maya. And last but not least, we we got all the three parts for uh yeah for the second yeah one one of the two one of the three endings that exists in this game so yeah today we're just gonna go ahead and get to all these three endings so yeah without further ado let's go ahead and get into this huh Uh, I'm just going to go casual mode uh, because, uh, as I said, uh, um, because I'm kind of a little not feeling well as of as of uh, recently, and then I'm kind of little still kind of a little burned out. I know it's kind of, I know some of you might actually wanted to see me, uh, you know, see me actually uh, you know, push myself to a little more, but now is actually not a good time to actually do that. Yeah, today we're just gonna go ahead and watch all three endings. Yeah, there are three endings, and I believe I actually did unlock uh, all uh, all the conditions for these three endings. I mean, one normal endings are pretty much good to go, if I know any better. But the other one. Is you actually have to rescue all the staffs that slash students, so Yep, this is it. Yeah, I can't believe we actually we actually came we we actually got it to this far and this has and I, i'm not gonna lie this has been quite the journey oh yeah but but yeah so and i won't lie i really um i really did enjoy it uh, although you know i really did enjoy this game uh really game although some people does have a conflicted feeling about this, you know, some people did it while... Well, you know, I did actually watch some people, you know, some people's review of the game. And while there are certain people who enjoy this game, you know, including those who are aware of, who knows about these, you know, you know the Galgan games. But also, uh, yeah, but they did not like it as well, because... Yeah, I think probably one of the big complaints of... You know, people uh, of these people, you know, of their opinions was that this game actually like barely had any, you know, the grindings or level up systems, which which I, which I do agree. But for me personally, um, as a someone who actually played uh, at least some, if not all of the, you know, Castlevania games and some Bloodstained games. You know the fact that you always, you know, make your way to the one segment to the room and then if you, you try to go for the other one, you know, and then the enemy does, you know, respond like immediately. That's kind of bothered me because, you know, especially when you're low on HP is that... I mean, you can actually grind your ways like that, but if you get hit by that, then it's pretty much GG and you have to start all over again. And that was a terrible nightmare to me, so... Anyway, I'll save my, my overall opinions of this game a little, um... After I beat the game at least once, and then, yep. Right now, we, let's just beat the crap out of the uh, Adele Corona. And what the heck is that dude right in on her feet? That dude looks awfully familiar, and I'm really hoping that is not who I think it is. Oh my fucking guy. Yes, my lady. Oh, 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 my fucking guy. Yes, my lady.
And just so you guys know, he actually looks pretty dang handsome than he I would than I originally thought because we don't because you know at the same game we don't act we don't um like not always but but usually we don't actually get to see what the protagonist actually looks like but then the moment I look but, but, but the moment you look at them and he looks pretty dang handsome and I'm like oh my god this game has so much of a betrayal shenanigan going on At least Shinobu can actually tell that he's doing. Are you sure that dude is a fake? Oh my fucking god. Are you a perilous? Like, peril, peril, you know, that lickiest, lickiest dude? Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Okay, so he actually slides, which means um, he actually has a very low um, trajectory going on. Ow. Jesus Christ, this dude. Ow. Ow. Okay, he's gonna die. So what you're supposed to do is- uh, Oh crap, I was doing the wrong way, god dang it. Yeah, this- yeah, Shinobu's this grenade here actually ha- ha- actually helps a lot, actually. Man, good, man, good thing is that our, we pretty much upgrade all- most- like, pretty much all of our, you know, the sub-weapons, so this was a piece of cake. もっ<笑> Corona, for once, I can't believe you actually just decided to come to the past and be like... Alright, I'm gonna clean up my past mistakes and whatnot. You know, this is kind of stuff. You know, you know, when I look at this scenario itself, part of it, I think it's gonna, it's gonna be very similar to... You know, it kind of reminds me of Sonic Generations, too. Just kind of prepare different weapons because yes, I've I've actually did a practice a practice match uh in my past uh, in my in my other account and man that was certainly yeah and I actually kind of died a lot to, uh fight, fighting against this adult Corona. So yeah, I, I kind of know what to do here. But, yeah, I kind of know figure what to do. So yeah, he's. So yeah, by the way, if you actually fall through there, I don't need to see that, but it's an it's, but it's actually an instant death. So you ha you actually have to start the battle all, all the way from that fake Kodai person. So you definitely kind of don't want that. Oh god. Yeah, and that lightning does actually tremendous amount of damage. So be careful. Yeah, time to use this. That was close. Whoa, that was even more close. That was like two that was like two close close calls in a row. But yeah, once you know the patterns and you know don't get too greedy, this or the Corona battle, especially the first round, especially with the first match, isn't it's surprisingly not all that difficult. And yeah, just don't get greedy. I uh, read the patterns. Don't feel any don't feel any time pressure because there's no time limit whatsoever, and then you're good to go.
この程度か<笑>またわらわはたんまり力を残しておるぞそんなバックパワーが跳ね上がったとてもないプレッシャー Yes, I guess the Corona really has been building up for, 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 for another like 100 years or so maybe Yeah, some people do predict this Edo Corona is basically like a 1,100 or maybe a millennia Or like a millennia years after, uh, you know, that chibi corona we were talking about. But the question is, what happened to the future? Uh, what about, uh, yeah, the adult, what's, what about the adult Ekoro or maybe, like, adult, adult uh, Ekoro or maybe Arisa, maybe, what happened to them? So you see these three endings? Uh, this one is basically your basic endings, you know, where if you don't, uh, if you didn't rescue, uh, if you haven't rescued all the, you know, 32 staffs, 32 staffs, nor gotten the, uh, nor gotten the final three devices, which is, uh, should be this one, then yeah, this is basically good two endings, but, uh, we'll do this right now, and then we'll get to the, these two other endings, like, later on. Yeah, and I believe you actually need to use the device to actually get into it because yeah, that's because you know we pretty much are, we, we pretty much you know forced our way through um through the through the mirror so yeah yeah so yeah that's why we can't actually choose this one so yeah that means we we basically have to fight against that corona uh, cr that you know the present corona once more which is pretty dang lovely if I do say so myself. <laughs> oh, they actually keep that? That's amazing. Oh, <laughs> ユダンする Oh boy. I'm surprised that Corona didn't actually end up destroying this castle, even though. Yeah, I mean. さあ、悪魔ハンターどもシャバンは終わりじゃ。今度こそお前らの最後にしようぜ。Thing that is actually quite, quite similar to what you know, you know, it's quite similar to what you know, Sonic Generation did, you know. And in, in, in the future, Eggman, you know, in the future, Eggman, and in, 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 in the and in you know, Robotnik, aka the past Eggman, kind of did cooperate actually, and then. Yeah, but I'm surprised. Why didn't they, why didn't they actually make uh bring back either adult Ekoro or maybe? Oh yeah, 
I, mean, I think Ekoro was in different games, right? But what they... What, but at least they could have actually brought the adult Risa and then act, they, she might, you know, they might have been put up a good fight, but surprisingly they didn't. I'm, I think this, I think that might actually be a, uh, I might, I think that's going to be a sequel for this game. If that, that might be a thing for the sequel. If that actually becomes a thing, that is. No, no, no promises though for, for that to be, to, for that to come in reality. All right, adult Corona, or oh, big bigger Corona. If that's what you want, let. Uh, uh, no, 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 wrong way, wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. What the heck? What the heck? Yeah, this one, this bed is actually pretty, a little, uh, little actually, it's kind of a little tough, and then, but, but if you actually know what you're doing, yeah, because if, I actually died a lot. Oh my god. Yeah, but patience is the key, uh, for this battle. Patience is the key. No need to get, no need to feel hastiness whatsoever, if, because if one hastiness does lead to... Uh, like fatal result and no one wants that Ow. oh crap Oops. i meant to go for maya and use this side. There you go. Now I'm just gonna shoot this uh, missile launcher because they are fast and uh, they actually deal more damage and it's actually open and sink. It has an open and sinking functions. I know it's got a little, uh, has a, uh, a little surprise in the weapon cost, but hey, still. Ow. So when this orb comes out, you, uh, you, you, yeah, this all you can, this all you can destroy. You can actually dodge it like that. You know, use an umbrella and go out of field, but make sure you don't fall. Oh. Yeah, I'm re yeah, I, I really, I'm. Re oh crap, that actually hit me. I need to heal. And she's done.
Dare I say it's defeating her alone it was all it all it took for us to send like put like put like sending her back to the future. Like no pun intended, I'll have you know. But seriously? Well, destroying that demon in the castle never gets old. Oh. Um. Yeah, putting her. Yeah, putting her out of commission is good and all. But something doesn't feel right. Um, I think you. I think um, Corona. Just so you guys, just just saying that you probably that the credit doesn't go to you alone. You know, I think the adult Corona who just got bodied by us right now. You know, you should actually. Yeah, I think adult Corona deserves like more than like more than half of the credits. I should say. Oh, I can't actually fast forward this. <laughs> That's interesting. So yeah, this is rather... I'd say normal, but the uh, very... I would say not a very good ending, to be honest. But yeah, um, just a little short opinion uh, for me to regarding this game is that... Yeah, they actually... Yeah, this Inti creates actually with the uh, with some you know good amount of experience of making a gunvolt game uh, for gunvolt series. They actually did a pretty dang good job. I mean, I. I mean, they actually made the game look like you know you know you know Kamisuno Shino uh, Kamisuno siblings actually live up to their demon hunters and but I certainly did not know they could actually do something like you know Castlevania series. Although this game actually has more closer to the. Yeah, what should we call it? Uh, yeah, Clutch of uh, Blood Stained. But yeah, um, I, I I don't know how people you know people you know those who are actually a very hardcore fan of yeah hardcore hard, hardcore fan of you know Castlevania series may not like this game because uh, as I just said, uh, you know because they, you know removing the yeah level up systems or grinding systems is probably gonna be their biggest complaint for this game and. Yeah, I kind of do sort of agree is that I kind of wish they would uh, in a day um, I mean, I wouldn't say it's a level up system, but I wish in you know, a day would actually You know had some you know level up systems. I mean kind of exists, you know how you actually you can actually you know upgrade You know your sub weapons, but I Something about that is kind of a little be a little vague or not would be a little unclear as to I mean should I even call that as a you know, level up systems, I don't think so actually. 
But yeah, um, overall, um, it's a really uh, overall. I think it's a really good game. You know, um, the game costs like what, like third, like thirty five dollars ish, and then, and I think, and, and I think, in, uh, considering how this game, um, still not that pricey, but it's not that cheap either. I think it's actually worth the price. I mean, if you want, I mean, if you are, I mean, like, if you have heard, the, if you, if you both heard the game before, but you're kind of not sure. Uh, what to what uh, you know what to begin because yeah trust me because Castlevania does have a quite a long history but you, you just don't know what to, right you know if you're unsure of uh, which you know what to start yeah yeah uh, you know what to start yeah yeah what uh, what to start then yeah uh, this might actually be a you know this might actually be a good game series to go i mean sure it's not exactly all that all, all not that much of a castlevania material but but at the very least you know you can actually get the gist of what the castlevania game is going to be like but that's all i have to say for this regarding to this you know regarding this Regarding this, Just fast for all this because I I've already told one of my opinions about this game and yeah and I know I probably gotta jinx myself for saying this but I do really sort they would actually get a sequel of this game but that means you know you actually but that means you I think more of the Gal Gun story may actually have to make a progress so that you can actually but you know they can actually. You know, they can actually get some... Have a wider universe to the Galgan universe. Whoa! Jeez. But yeah, once you actually beat the game once, you know, this, you know, this, all this question mark will now be unlocked. Boss Rush. 